Thank you, Joe. Now to the lakeshore, a Holland landmark defaced by vandals. The Holland Lighthouse, more affectionately known as Big Red, hit last week, and now we're learning more. 24-Hour News 8's Mark Thompson is live now with what happened and how it was pulled off. Mark? Yes, yeah, Susie, if you take a look behind me, you can see the Holland Lighthouse, or Big Red as it's known, off in the distance there behind me. Officials say that it was late Wednesday that vandals struck. Maintenance workers were in the process of painting that lighthouse, and they discovered that damage Thursday morning. They believe the vandals gained access by climbing up a ladder on the south side that was already in place for that painting process, and they broke through a window. Once inside, they dumped several gallons of paint that was already inside on the basement floor, furnace, and ceiling. Then making their way upstairs, damaging a historical picture display and destroying a flag stand dedicated to the five branches of the armed services. Officials with the Holland Harbor Lighthouse Commission estimate the damage at over $2,500, but say money isn't the only cost. In, in fact, John Gronberg of the Holland Harbor Lighthouse Commission says that it's a volunteer organization that looks after the lighthouse, and there have been many people who have been interested in preserving the maritime history and the history of the Great Lakes, and so to have something like like this occur, it's a bit disheartening, especially since this is such a popular icon in this part of western Michigan. In fact, that structure, that lighthouse, has been around since 1907. Now, the vandals did leave some clues behind in the form of painted shoe prints that they tracked all throughout the lighthouse. The Ottawa County Sheriff's Department, they're handling the investigation, and right now they don't have any suspects, but they're asking anyone with information to give them a call. Live in Holland, Mark Thompson, 24 Hour News 8. Thank you, Mark.